Hello, welcome to Minecraft. Today I'm going to be showing you a video to demonstrate how to expel chickens from your mob spawner slash mob grinder. If you have an animal farm, which this would be representative of where the animals fall in the canal, if you have an animal farm over here and you tend to spawn a lot of chickens, you will notice that they are the exception to the rule in that they will fit underneath this one block space where the lava is and they will continue on into your home or wherever you have your collection point and that can become very annoying if you have a buildup of chickens in any area so I'm going to show you the principle that allows this um, trap that kills the chickens to work and it's going to help you to understand how this needs to be set up so like most mobs whenever a chicken is in the water let's get a chicken When a chicken is in the water, like most mobs, it has a natural tendency to want to jump. As soon as it hits the water, it's going to jump repeatedly, and that will cause it to stay on top of the water. You may see here that this, you can fit through here, and I can easily pass through that if I just allow myself to fall, but the chickens and the other mobs are unaware of this, and they will continue to jump if they are in the water. So what that's going to do is allow you to make this little device that's going to prevent them from escaping your trap. First thing you're going to need to do if you have it already built is you're going to need to block off this water because you can't plant the, plant the cactus otherwise. Wherever this water, usually it's two blocks, well in this instance the lava is two blocks long. So after the lava stops I need one block of air and then I need the cactus. So I'm just going to, let's see, the two, the block of air, and the cactus can be right here. But just to make it a little bit easier to see, I'm going to make this block the empty space, and I'm going to plant my cactus right here. The two block, the block you choose to plant your cactus on, you need one block behind that, and all the way to the rest, you need to make that one block down. Now, a cactus needs open area on each side of it on each side in order for it to be able to be planted so you're going to want to clear out the sides plant your cactus and make sure there's an open space on each side now whichever direction you prefer the water to travel in is up to you I'm going to pick the left side you're going to want to delete the blocks around the cactus you're kind of making a channel for the water to pass around now the way this trap is going to work is that water is going to come out here and it's going to flow down this block it's going to travel down one block and the items will sink because items do not jump and they will continue on to your collection point however a chicken is going to follow this water which will stop at the cactus it's going to stop at the cactus and they're going to keep jumping so they're going to end up landing on top of the cactus now the reason this is going to work is because you're going to block off this general area that the chickens are going to go to and you're going to not allow them to escape the block that the cactus is on. So once you have done that, you can let the water through. And you see how the, the top of the water goes to the cactus, but the items that fall into it will sink down and continue on. So you block that off so they end up getting stuck here. And this is basically the entire trap and how it's going to kill the chickens. So let's see if it's not going to take 20 eggs to spawn a chicken this time. Apparently it will. Oh Jesus. Or it's going to spawn four. That's great. It's going to showcase this trap well. Chicken gets stuck where the cactus is and he is going to die. You don't necessarily need his feathers. The feathers are going to get destroyed but that's not. that doesn't really matter. Feathers are kind of useless. This trap is very efficient. Usually the chicken will hurt itself on the lava before it continues and die very quickly. So, there's your chicken killing machine at the end of your mob trap, and I hope you guys like this video and you find some good use for it, and I'll see you guys next time.